guys. I'm Jenny with Show Me Cute, and guess what? School let out this week. Uh, all the moms are like, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. It's really that not that bad. I get to sleep in. I get to chill out. I'm so excited. Um, it's really hot here already, so we've already been enjoying the lake. Um, all summer long, I plan to have all kinds of ideas and things for you guys to do for the summer. And we're going to start off today with this adorable do-it-yourself iPad cover. First thing you want to do is take your iPad or your tablet, whichever you're going to do, and find a book that is very close to the same size as your tablet. And then we're going to cut out all of the pages that are inside. Be very careful not to cut all the way through. A couple of weeks ago I did a fabric covered book video for you guys and we're going to do a lot the same as that video. I will put a link in the description box below so that you can go back and refer to that one for part of this process. First thing you're going to want to do after you have your book cover is cut out your fabric that's going to surround your book and I'm going to leave about a two inch rim. This is where we're different from the fabric covered books. Right now we look like this and how cute is that gonna be? And so what we need to do is make the inside look very pretty on this one because we're going to see it. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut a strip that's gonna come only about halfway over and you'll see why only about halfway over in, a, in when we as we progress but I'm gonna cut a strip of fabric that fits to that area and glue that on Next we're going to do our board that's going to go on this side that will actually hold your tablet. I'm going to use a piece, I had this um, board, it's a heavy mat board that you can get at a craft store. You could also recycle the back um, from a picture frame. There's all kinds of things that you could use, but you want it to be a really thick piece of sturdy cardboard, not a flimsy piece. Okay, again taking my iPad I'm going to lay it down on my board and I've cut four pieces of elastic those are about four inches long and I'm going to lay it over and just see how much I need or how far down I need it to come so that it gives a good uh, overlap on the corner and I measured that with my ruler and it was about an inch and a half so then I'm taking my sharpie and I'm going to make a dot at an inch and a half on the corners all the way around. I did all four elastics. They are all nice and secure on there with my hot glue. And now the last thing is just to line that up on the bottom of my cover. And I'm going to use lots of extra hot glue and get all of it nice and secure. This is my finished product and I am super in love and I think Bella is going to be super in love as well. 
How cute! And so if you guys want more information about what I've showed you today and more details, pictures, where I shopped, blah, 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 all those kinds of things, go to showmecute.com. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you next week. Bye.